this out. I believe this is maybe a bobcat. Not sure, but somebody's skinned it. Looks pretty cool. There's the body and the head and the skin. Awesome. Love it. This is uh, one of the other teacher's apartments right here. This is her front door. And then at the other end of the building is uh, the another teacher's apartment. I've shown you mine quite a few times. This is out over the um, river out behind the school that you've seen a few times in videos. It's pretty calm right now. Um, and then some other houses. And then this is back out toward the ocean again. This is the, like I said, the uh, one of the other teacher housing buildings. And these are all two bedrooms. All of the teacher housing is two bedrooms. And if you're single, you may end up sharing with somebody. By the way, Patricia here, Stampin' Up! Demonstrator in the United States, but more specifically here in Alaska. And this is the front door. And then that building right there, I think I've pointed it out to you before, uh, is the store, or I should say used to be the store. It is now um, all the way down at the other end of town, back out across the ocean. As you can see, out to the cliffs over there. And I'll just walk around along the road. I don't know that I've done this, and I certainly haven't done this in the summertime. It's fall now, of course, but we have no trees here, so it's not like we really have a lot of color change. But anyway, I'll walk along and show you some things. This is an old house that nobody lives in anymore. That's probably their new house, another old house. Um, they don't tear down the houses here. They are left to go back to nature and you know that's what it is here in the village so um, a little bit different but it's their lifestyle which is fine um, anyway I'm gonna walk along I think I already pointed this one out and you don't go in any of these buildings most are probably locked up anyway but this was a nice size house at it one time and here comes somebody on their Honda this is one of our somewhat recent graduates and now he's in town um, doing his thing whatever he's doing these days uh oh somebody's Honda on its side maybe they're working on it did you lose it <laughs> And we're coming up here to some guys doing some blown-in insulation. I looked at it. Hopefully that wind is not too bad and you can hear me. But when I walked by here a few minutes ago, they uh, were putting some of that insulation, the blown-in insulation in. So, kind of cool to watch. Hey, hey, how's it going? I am very good. You getting new insulation, huh? You gotta love that. Love it. And, uh, oh, somebody's snow go they're working on. Some more old housing and then newer stuff. Hey, hey, how's it going? On the beach, you can go as fast as you want. Up here on the road, it's supposed to be 25 miles an hour or so. You know, sometimes people don't always follow the rules. <laughs> I know you can't imagine such a thing, you know? Does do that. 
that a lot of places, right? <laughs> okay, maybe every place. <laughs> anyway, um, so I'm almost back here to the school. And if the wind weren't blowing, which is probably making this sound really, really bad, um, I would walk down to the new store. It's still not terribly cold yet. Let me go ahead and see if I can switch the video. Uh, let me look out at the ocean so I can see the screen. See if it'll let me switch. Uh, it doesn't look like it's going to let me switch. Uh, and here's some seagulls. Hmm. I thought it would let me. Oh, I guess you can only do that if you're doing a live. I was going to switch it and show me you. Show you me. <laughs> I can talk. Here, let me just turn it around and show me. I can't see what is going on because I had to actually turn the phone. But, you know, um, the only reason I was really showing you what I'm looking like at the moment is because when I did a video along this area before is I was... Um, all in my parky and everything and my boots and insulated skirt and all that all right i'll go back to the village um oh this is the parking lot here at the school everybody's hondas and there's an actual truck here's another honda again we call them hondas even if they are um uh not hondas per se and then this is the playground I can show it to you because there are no kids here right at the moment. And I'm gonna go to the door. These, by the way, are the blocks that we put at the end, either end of this walkway. You see how it's all graded that goes up to the front door of the school? And they will put those on there if it gets too dangerous to walk on that in the winter time. Kind of weird, huh? But nonetheless, there we go. Okay, I did show you a little bit of my classroom the other day. And uh, I can probably go ahead and do that. I'm not doing a live right now. This will be pre-recorded. So, I'm uh, not sure if anything's changed in my classroom since I showed you. But i got to unlock the door here. There we go. way and my classroom they're learning to count and I'm so happy you're here you guys too right <laughs> and I think I already showed you the uh, alphabet board the lights just came on in my room and oh we have the Alaska flag there we go oh and here you gotta see this Miss Hauser's class my sister, my youngest sister, made this for me many, many, many years ago. So this is just another quick view of my classroom. We're still working on our plants this year. And we are getting some more um, uh, shelves. So that'll make it nice in the closet right there that's in really bad shape. <laughs> But today is the 26th. Yesterday was my brother's birthday. This is some of our new sorting. This is where the kids put their work, some of their games, their books that they use every day, etc. Okay, that's it. My classroom in a quick nutshell. And um, again, thank you for watching so much. Not quite 10 minutes here on the video. The sun is nice and bright outside, but that wind is a little um, harsh. So, all right, there's some cards I've made. I'll have to show you some more of those next time. Loves and hugs, everybody, and thank you for watching.